Hi, it's Corrine for Wild Orchid Crafts, and today I thought I would share this sweet little gift box with you. I have a full start to finish on how this came together that I'll play in just a moment, but I thought I would just give you a quick overlook of this. This is a cameo cutout. I bought the file from the online silhouette store, which I'll link in the description box, along with all the gorgeous products that I used from Wild Orchid Crafts. And currently they have discounts that they're running. Um, they also have free shipping and they've added lots of new products to their store. So I would urge you to go by there and check out all that they have to offer. They have a lot of Christmas items to offer and you'd be shocked over their prices. They're really, really good prices. They're, they box everything so beautifully when you get it in the mail. Their shipping is very quick and I can't say enough about Wild Orchid Crafts. So Check them out, check out the description box and you'll find all the information. Like I said, along with this cut file, if you don't own a Cameo or Cricut, you can buy it directly from the person's website, which I'll link that in the description box as well. And you can simply print it out and cut it by hand. Um, again, I'll link you to everything in the description box. So just to quickly go over everything on here, I use this Blush Glam by Craftsman Paper gorgeous paper collection. I got this from Michaels quite a while ago. And I also use this. This is from We Are Memory Keepers. And it's this polka dot clear acetate paper that is in my window here. And around the outside of the box, I use this gorgeous white Guy, Guy Pure Lace from Wild Orchid Crafts and added the flat back pearls around it. For the base of my box, I used Craft. I love the look of Craft with this blush glam. And on the front here, I used this cutout set. This is the Trio Collection Frame Pattern 2. And uh, you can ink these, you can stain them, you can spray them, whatever you'd like. I left it the natural color. I added this beautiful quote, again, that I got from the online silhouette store. And I did back that by chipboard, so it's, it's sitting up a little dimensional. I use these beautiful off-white chrysanthemums, some magnolias. I used an ivory bloom from the Summer Blooms. I love tucking those in. They have such dimension. I added some twine that I had in my stash. And here's a baby pink center wild rose. And underneath it is a chrysanthemum. I just took out the center of it. I tucked in some hip rosebuds here and there. And I also added some white leaves. And these are some of my favorite to use. These are the flat back glitter balls from Wild Orchid Crafts and a little bow that I cut from the Cameo out of the same craft cardstock. So when you open it up, this is actually, it has a divider on the inside that you can choose to add or not add, but this is actually for stationery. It'll hold stationery or, or little cards and envelopes, stamps. I thought it's going to make a great gift to give all these beautiful flowers and then some of the cabochons from Wild Orchid Crafts. All of these I'll be sure to link in the description box as well. And this uh, white pearl trim flower, gorgeous. So I thought this is going to make a great Christmas gift. And it's be beautifully housed in this box. So I hope you stay tuned for these start to finish. If you have any questions, please leave me a comment. Please give me a thumbs up and make sure to stop.